have for one or two more questions. No, I can't even see anymore. Just start talking. Hi, up here. Uh, going back to the land concert thing, uh, when we were in Loretto, you had the food festival and you could pre-purchase your tickets. This year we ran into a situation where we were literally the first person at the desk to get our tickets. Right. But I don't carry cash. Right. <laughs> and then the chef was so sweet, he actually came up to us and offered to take us in his personal car <laughs> into town to get to an ATO machine. I mean, he was amazing. It's amazing and also sort of irresponsible. <laughs> to get into a stranger's car. Yeah. <laughs> Mom taught me that. Um, but um, is it possible to possibly go back to the pre-purchase of tickets so that you could do that and not have to worry about carrying cash? I mean, I, it seemed like it worked well in Loretto, maybe. Well, yeah, so Loretto, we, it was sort of like we, we jumped out of an airplane without a parachute and somehow a bunch of birds formed around <laughs> us <laughs> managed to land. Um, and this year, it was a totally different setup. And I know that, that there were a couple things, I think there had been an ATM machine that had been planned to be there, that didn't function. And next year, uh, we think the land concert is going to be in Santo Domingo, so we're going to be working with the destination management company on that. Yeah, there, there were a few communication disconnects uh, between us and, and the venue, and it's not to say anything bad about that. There were, uh, expectations and, and things uh, regarding we we had we, it had been our understanding that every place would accept cash and credit card uh, and they worked very quickly to try and rectify that situation we're going to work very much more closely whatever the food situation is in Santo Domingo to absolutely confirm what is available and how and when so you'll be pre-armed to know what to bring a uh, storm uh, Drew can probably I'm sort of assuming speak more towards the uh, pre-purchase uh, option yeah. Well, I, I mean, the, the, the truth is that we, uh, everything we sent over and everything we got back never indicated there, there would be tickets. Um, we yeah. thought that it was going to be direct purchase. Um, so this is something where we're, we're still learning a lot of these venues. They realize that tickets are going to make it easier at their individual assists, uh, point of sales for food to do it. Um, but they don't necessarily communicate that to us because I think that they come to that realization later. So we can pre-sell these things, but we need to set that up, and that's that's actually a piece of feedback I got in, in another meeting earlier today. And that's great to hear because now we know maybe we go to the folks at Santa Domingo and say, "This is what we want to do. You know, we want to have a ticket system." So thank you. Yeah. 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 Yeah